Hey everyone, James and Mark here with another mukbang. Today, mm -hmm. as per tradition, it's becoming, we're having raw marinated crab. And we ordered these straight from Korea. These are internationally shipped to us <laughs> right before Christmas. We uh, have had it in our freezer for a little while, but we finally feel good enough to have this meal. Uh, everything looks vibrant and colorful. I wonder if it's gonna be just as good as the restaurant, if not better. So we have the two types, of course. We have the spicy version of this, and then we also <laughs> have the soy sauce marinated version as well. What is it in Korean? Do you remember? Yang yum. Kejang? Oh, yes. Which and one is Yangnyum Kejang? Oh, that one. Okay. Because I remember it from chicken. Oh, gosh. Soy sauce marinade? Kejang Kejang. <laughs> kejang Kejang? I always say the same thing. I don't know. Kanjang Kejang. Kanjang. What does that word mean? Kanjang. Kanjang means soy sauce. Oh. Uh, and also, Mark's fried up some eggs, which Ooh. arguably might be more expensive than the crabs now because egg prices have just soared through the roof. Uh, why don't we start with beer? Yes. Uh, obviously, we're not practicing dry January, but we're talking. We're kind of slowing down a little bit. I'd say out of all the months, January is usually our. Let's get everything back together, and then we start everything up back in February and March. Because February is like our anniversary. Um, we're coming up on five years actually, uh, and we have something kind of cool coming up, but we can't tell you exactly. So just subscribe if you want to find out what what that's all about. And then March is our birthdays, so it's like we can't naturally, it naturally we just can't get away from like having a good time. Cheers, Cheers. everybody. Mm. Oh. oh, oh, that's good, that's good. Very delicious. You want gloves? I think I'm okay, I'm just gonna. You're just gonna. Uh, free, free fall it? Free ball? Free ball? Free ball. Free I am free ball. balling right now. You're free balling right now? Yes, maybe. Mm -mm. You know how these uh, well, well, raw marinated crab videos are. There's a lot of innuendos in these. Well, that's one less underwear I have to wash. Ew! <laughs> <laughs> They're very saucy. Yeah, so I'll just Oh, that's the one some. I was gonna oh, grab. Oh, grab it, grab it, grab it. Yeah, grab it for you. Okay. Oh! Look at that. Oh, this one's... Oh! Okay, I'm kind of intimidated. Legs, legs, legs. I know, so I'll just do something that's easier to grab. <laughs> Are you squeezing it out? I'm just gonna put it in my mouth and then squeeze it out. <laughs> it's easy... Sometimes it's oh. easier to squeeze a little bit out. I put it on and then took it out. Oh! Mmm! <sighs> Oh my god. Oh, the spicy sauce is really good. Mmm. There's like two things going at play right now. Like the, the crab itself is like nice and cold, but then the spice is like heating things up. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. <clears throat> now I heard some of you actually go back and watch there's one year where we did this raw marinated crab and it got a little wild. Someone recently commented and said, I periodically go back to this video. What happened? I don't remember. I just say, we it was just funny and we were just really enjoying the food. So I hope that this updated 2023 version is to your liking. Oh, uh, this one is good. And I grew up liking Yum Yum Kejang more. Because mm. of the sauce. It has... Flavor profile with my name all over mm -hmm. it. It's sweet. It's really spicy, right? This is the messiest I've ever seen you eat in your life. Save that for me later. It looks like he has rouge on his lips. I'm your kitten. Hmm. <laughs> it's like an endless supply of meat that's just coming out of this just this little part here. You just had to bite and suck. Mm. Bite and suck. We might need My to technique do, is down pat, okay? We might need to do a tutorial video for those that never had this before. It's like, mm. how do I really eat this, you know? Mm. Step one, bite. <laughs> Close your Step eyes two, if you want. Suck. Um, but in the body, we do like to squeeze it out like toothpaste. You know, when you really want to get the last ounce of the toothpaste because you're too lazy to get the new Mm -hmm. um, tube from the linen closet. So. What do you mean? I always get the new tube when we're empty. <laughs> Girl's been dry. <laughs> Ooh, careful girl. We didn't make our dentist appointment for the year yet. Mm. 
And some of these uh, bigger legs have a lot of meat in it too. Yeah, I think this one is not really prime for it, but I'm gonna suck on that. But you could still you could still bite and suck. Even the small legs. Mm. All right, now this one is my favorite, and I think we mentioned this before. It kind of reminds me of Flintstone push-ups. Is that what it's Pull-ups? <laughs> push-ups. Push-ups push because ice cream bar. the orange is exactly the same color, and then yeah, look at all that egg. Oh my gosh, okay. Ready? Mm. Oh, and you know what? This mm. place does their marinade really good. Mm. <gasps> Mm. Mm. <laughs> What's is the sound? mic picking up all the sounds? What's that sound? I haven't heard that in a really long well, time. Well, you should try harder. <laughs> well, I just need to grow six more legs. No, just get me a tub of this and bring it to me to bed. Oh, wow. Mm. <clears throat> mm. This is so good. Oh my god, I, I'm I'm actually really uh, impressed. Impressed. I want to say this might be the best uh, one that I've had. Even though like we had it in the freezer and it, it's not like you know right away freshest because like if you're not gonna eat it right away, you're yeah. supposed to keep it in the freezer, right? But even with it being frozen, like. My it's gosh. phenomenal. It it's, just had a lot of the orange essence. It retained its flavor for sure. And the the marinade sauce of this place, Samde Incheon Gejang, whatever you know in Korea, really good. Um, I saw on their label that they've been in business since 1962. We got this down on Pat. Hmm. I don't know why I'm closing my eyes, but it just feels right. <laughs> it's intimate, you know? When do we eat these eggs? Just right now? Whenever? I have an egg with you. Well, surprisingly, the crab is more bright orange than these yolks. And these yolks are pretty bright, too. We need some sunglasses on. <laughs> oh my god, they're perfectly cooked. Like, why use a spoon anymore? Mmm. Mmm. It's good with the egg. Ooh, with this a little bit of this sauce too, might as well. It really balances each other out. Like it has a similar texture. Mm-hmm. But different flavor profile, you know? Yeah, mm. for sure. Mmm. I can imagine if you don't like slurping videos, uh, raw marinated crab, crab mukbangs are probably not for you. Just, just saying. Mm. Or a crunching sound. Yeah. I think the soy sauce really gets into like all the nooks and crannies of the crab. Yeah, and if you're not familiar with the soy sauce one, it's not straight up soy sauce. It's like soy sauce brewed with like a lot of like radish and Korean pear and other like and water. So it's kind of diluted, but has a lot of flavor, you know? So it's not like a super salty dish. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of nervous about eating this crab on camera. I might eat the rest of it off. Cause remember that one time we went out and the lobster came back and like clawed, like latched on my lip and then I ripped it off in a panic and then it like tore it and I started bleeding. It was not cute. You were bleeding a lot, but for some reason, if it was any other time, you would like be like, oh, it hurts. And you'd be all pissed and like not in a good mood. And you're bleeding a lot, right? But then because you're eating lobster, you didn't care if you're bleeding or if all your limbs were torn apart, you are still going to eat that lobster in a very happy state of being, you know? Yeah, yeah, for sure. I, so I it, wasn't in a mood, huh? I had some Heineken that day, though. <laughs> you did, you did. That always helps, right? Yeah. <laughs> I sound like with, I sound like I'm at like an estuary, and then there's all of these like scientific birds that you have to like look for, and that one is a specific like. You know? 
I Don't dare you to like record it and submit it to the Smithsonian <laughs> saying that it's like a rare species of some bird and then they're going to believe you and you're going to get all the credit for discovery of new species. <laughs> Sometimes when I use the restroom and Mark walks by, he thinks a new species has been born in there, right? Yeah, I didn't Can know you... you're able to give birth to strange things. <laughs> oh my god, I feel like I'm getting buzz off of crab. It's a, it's like a, yeah, it's a, it's giving you like a natural high. <laughs> I need, I need that beer. God, there's so much meat. In this one. Yeah. Just don't neglect the legs. Mm -mm. It's a leg day for sure. Oh! It just came out? It came out and it went to the back of my throat. Mm. That one, I felt my heart go up a little bit. <laughs> and back down. <laughs> okay, we need to take a little bitesies. I gotta save some rice. I always have to remember to save rice because. There's a, a reason why we have rice in this dish, and if you watched our other um, raw marinated crab video when we went to Cape Town, you'll know why. Stick around, it's happening in like 20 seconds. Mm. It does, spicy sauce with rice is good too, huh? Mm -hmm. They're all good. It's addicting. All right, so should we do the body? The body, yeah, body, body, yaddy, 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 yaddy. yeah. I'm ready for the body. Okay. We brought our a chukamon for the rice, so a little bit of sesame oil and some seaweed should be perfect accessories to the main. Here are the bodies. Dang, Mar, you got a little messy. Like, you made a mess there too. That's me? Yeah, that's you. Is that just you being overly messy? No, that, I, it no, I know, no, whatever. Okay, all right, so we'll grab one. Look at all that. You don't really have to do anything to it, right? It's no. just as is. Because mind you, all of that liquid that you see in there is actually the marinade. Yeah. Probably some of the crab too, but. Oh yeah, there, there's some meat in here and the, and the eggs. Some uh, sesame oil. Look at that. You could even scoop this out and then pour it on your seaweed. Mm. Okay, that should be good. And then mix this up. Mm, that, this looks good, huh? Yeah. I'm wearing black gloves, so I don't know if I have seaweed left over on my hand or not. <laughs> Here, I'll lift it up this way so you can kind of see. Yeah, I mix it up really well. <gasps> this is always like my favorite part. Okay, I'm gonna get a nice little scoopy scoop here. Can you, oh, can you see that? Oh. Okay, ready? Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh my god. What is this? Is this allowed? <laughs> mm. That's really good. That was really good. <gasps> what are you doing? You nasty. <laughs> <laughs> just just pour some in here. We didn't even need to throw up the seaweed. We no, could just yeah. eat, eat it like this. A little like hand roll. Mmm. Oh, that was good. That's a good way of eating this. Mmm. Ah! <gasps> I know you can't touch my back, but it's there. All the goosebumps. Or is that an allergic reaction? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that one was. Oh yeah. That was good. That That's was how good, I want to huh? eat it from now on. That's good, huh? Oh! Like a little hand roll. This time we're gonna, oh yeah. 
How much, how is it possible to have this much flavor in something so small mm. like this? Huh? Tell me. We thought 2022 was a really good year for us. I don't know. I feel like it's the year of the crab and I thought it don't even exist, but this year is the year of the crab. Oh my God. I'm sad, but you know, the good thing, we didn't tell you all this. We have another container of each in the freezer. So whenever we want, um, actually I saw the date, like we should eat it before <laughs> April, but that's still, a, you know, a few months away. Yeah. We have a little bit of time. You know, for my last body, mm -hmm. I'm just going to eat it with, with the rice that I have left over here. So I'm going to try to squeeze out. <gasps> mm. um, but I want to give you this one. That's incredible. Look at that. I just want to squeeze this out to my rice and then mix it up like a... Like a... Like a uni rice, rice almost? Like a uni rice dish. <gasps> Oh my god, what? Oh my gosh. That's a lot for just one pair. I'm gonna set this down and suck on you later. <gasps> but am I gonna do this? Um, can you, oh. can you give me a little bit of sesame oil? Girl. Okay. There we go. Whenever you make rice, it looks so good. This is no exception. Look how orange this is. Okay. And if you want. What do I want? Tilt this plate a little bit mm. to add more of this sauce on here. Yes, that's enough for me. Make yourself a little, re oh, make yourself a little like risotto. I feel like I've seen this at like those hip sushi restaurants. But they use uni. I know this is gonna be good. Mmm. Oh, this is actually better than the body, like with the seaweed. You turn off the camera. <laughs> you ready? Ready for what? Trying to make them noises. Mmm. Well, there you go. <laughs> oh yeah. Just... Well, since we bought this from Korea, do they ship everywhere or where's the shipping zone? <laughs> I think they do ship it everywhere. Um, but they don't sell it throughout the year. They mm, only sell it in season, yeah. Mm. I mean, yeah, you don't want to eat these off season. You want to eat them when they're fresh and the best. Mm. Y'all, you don't even know. I know every time, every now and then we'll get someone that watches it and said, I wish I could try that. So there's a way that you could try it. We hope that you can. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Look at. Is that my mole or a red sauce? Both. Both? <laughs> well, of course the mole should be there still. Okay, y'all, we can't, we can't finish in front of y'all, so. <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, uh, make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe, and we'll see you for our next mukbang. Bye. Love you.